What's up, y'all? Merry Christmas and happy holidays. Today I have with me the 2023 UFC Optic Blaster Box. Since Panini is losing their UFC license, they may just be trying to dump all of their sticker autos. So is this product loaded? Let's find out. There's something good in here. <laughs> Don't eat it. <laughs> Let's get into this 2023 UFC Optic retail blaster box all right so i found these at uh walmart local walmart i think it was around 30 bucks like usual 29.99 a little bit more expensive than the chronicles retail which was interesting i guess this is technically more of a premium product than chronicles but the chronicles blasters were pretty loaded uh, as you can see here we do have the signature series autos in here the blaster exclusive is going to be the purple velocity numbered 259 and what I really thought was interesting is there could potentially be a one, uh, one of one gold vinyl signature series. If we hit that today, would be amazing. I am not expecting that <laughs> at all. As you guys know, with uh, these retail products, if you've watched our other videos, usually not the best. But it is Christmas time, you know. I got I got my hat going. Uh, the jingle bells are jingly. The snow is falling. Not really. It's Texas. It's like 70 degrees outside. I got shorts on. Uh, but since, you know, it's the Christmas time holiday spirit, I figured treat yourself, right? Let me treat myself and get one of these. Uh, you know, low expectations, but we'll see what we get. Uh, hopefully, if we can get a purple velocity of 59, that would really, you know, probably be a win here for these. All right. Bilal Muhammad. And we know after Leon's domination of Colby, He's probably going to get the title shot. Uh, reading all the comments and in the zeitgeist, it seems like Bilal is the guy. Alexander Volkanovsky, Tyler Santos, Tisha Torres, and we got a hollow here, a silver. Jan Blachowicz. Nice card there. All right. Keep it going. We continue our quest for the purple velocity or the gold vinyl one of one. If, if we hit a gold vinyl, I may never buy another retail product because <laughs> that would be the biggest hit of all time. All righty, pack two, Uriah Faber, Macy Barber, The Eagle, Habib Nurmagomedov, Rose, Thug, Nama Yunus. Ooh, we got a purple here. All right. Cyril Gone purple. And... It's just a prism. Please comment below. Do y'all ever buy retail products or do you just stay away completely? Do you think it's worth 20 or $30 of fun to open it up and see what's inside? Or do you just want to buy a 20 or $30 single on eBay? Please answer below. So it must be with these, maybe just the velocities are of 59. That's what I'm guessing. We got the retail exclusive purple color, which is not numbered. And then probably the uh, velocities, which are going to be of 59. Magomed Ankolaev, Usman, rumored to fight. Maybe there's a rematch with Chimaev. I don't know. I doubt Hamzat would take that fight, but I think the people would like to see that in a five-rounder. The Iceman, Chuck Liddell. Oh, is this an auto? Nice, man. Matt Schnell auto out of a blaster. And the Z Zhang Weili Dominators. So as we expected uh, with the intro... I think Panini's dumping a lot of these sticker autos, man. And now retail is becoming a little bit more value in the retail products. A little bit more reasonable with the price tag. Is it worth $30? Probably not. But it's a lot closer than it was last year or even, you know, two years ago. Makes it a little more fun when you actually get anything in return. All right, we got the Curtis Razor Blades. Charles Dubronx Oliveira. Uh, with Justin Gaethje here. Look at this bruise, man. That fight was actually really close. I know uh, Oliveira ended up finishing it and becoming the champ, but I I thought Gaethje was going to finish it multiple times. I think he dropped him twice in that. I'm not sure, but that was a great fight. Henry Cejudo, Alexa Grasso, and <laughs> Colby Chaos Covington. Seventh layer hair. I mean, seventh layer of hell. I'm going to bring you to a place you never want to be. I'm going to bring you the seventh layer hair. Hell. Okay. Man, just not not a fan of that kind of trash talk. When it when it gets super personal and like 
mean spirited i i don't i'm not really about that fight the guy you know like why are you even talking smack all right jared cannonier sean strickland devasan figueredo damon jackson the mega mind look at that head guys look at that head uh, somebody was calling him uh beavis beavis and butthead he does kind of look like that too rated rookie is this a gold right here oh it's the rising sun uh sean brady rising sun <laughs> and uh you guys know how i feel about this design they kind of got me with that gold tip too i thought we might have something good there fooled me fool me all right this is our last pack <sighs> no purple velocity that's really kind of what i wanted to see out of this but uh maybe we'll get lucky right here let's see or not most likely <laughs> most likely we won't because this is a retail product all right, Patty Pimblett, Jalen, the Tarantula Turner, Josh Barnett. Uh, I think he was one of the first guys to really patent that, like, case like a Tommy, like, scarf hold, where it's really like a diaphragmatic, like, asphyxiation choke. It feels horrible. And I think he was really good at that one. All right, we got Marab Duvalishvili. And is this is in my house. Got the Connor McGregor in my house. And that's a blue, huh? I haven't seen the blue yet. Or is it purple? Let's see. I guess that's purple. Kind of hard to tell on the camera. Either purple or blue. All right, that was quick. We did not have many cards to pack up for hits because, as expected, this retail, not the best. Retail products, guys. Eesh. Only get them if you just want some fun. If you're expecting any return, probably not going to get it. All right, let's check this out. We got the Jan Blahovitz Silver. We got the Colby Covington silver, seventh layer hair. Oh, okay. We got the Cyril Gone purple. So this is gonna be the blaster ex exclusive here. So if you guys really dig this purple uh, look, then uh, maybe this product's for you, you know? And we got the My House here, purple My House. It's kind of a like a dark blue almost. It's, it's really not even purple. And we got the Matt Schnell signature series, Matt Danger. Chanel, good auto too, man. Definitely put some time into that, that's nice. I know they have like hundreds and hundreds, maybe thousands of stickers to sign, but um, I appreciate it when, when people take their time on the autos. Also, uh, Matt Chanel, I believe has a YouTube channel where he opens uh, products sometimes. I don't know if he still does, but I saw him open one product a long time ago on his channel. So you guys can uh, search for him if you wanna support him and check that out. And that concludes the 2023 UFC Optic Retail Blaster Box. I'm going to say don't buy these, y'all. Doesn't seem like a huge return. Me, personally, not a huge fan of the Purple Parallels either. We didn't get to check out the Purple Velocity, which Velocities are pretty sweet design. You know, maybe uh, I have a different opinion if we hit one of those. Also, the box does say it might be a 101 gold vinyl auto in here. Is that true? Who knows? We can't trust Panini. Everybody knows that. But, you know, if that is true and, and word gets out that that's possible, then maybe it might be worth rolling the dice. Thanks for sticking with us for another year, for liking, for subscribing, for all the comments. I love to interact with you all there. We are going to be having uh, future product videos. We've got some mail that got sent in, uh, which I can't wait to open. It's amazing that people actually sent stuff <laughs> when we started this channel. There was nobody interacting, no one was watching. And to know that people are actually watching this and hopefully enjoying some of it is a really cool feeling. And I'm excited to check that out with Eric in probably a week, we're trying to schedule. Uh, we also have um, a product that I, that I picked up uh, here recently from the Walmart that I want him to open just kind of as a Christmas gift for him. And uh, yeah, more, more videos to come. So thanks for sticking with us, y'all.